What's good, sneaker fam? Welcome back to our sneakers. Before I start, I do want to give a big shout out to the people over at Frenzy for sending me this hoodie. Anyways, moving on with the video, today I do have a new product to show you guys. This is actually a product that I don't think any retailer carries at this moment, but I'm pretty sure they will be having this in March, especially according to Foot Locker. They did tweet out today that they will be having this product in their stores. If you guys do follow Kaiser's channel, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this probably once in one of his videos. And that was back when they were working on this product. But fortunately enough, I was able to pick this up last weekend at SneakerCon Fort Lauderdale. They were selling all their other crep products and they had this on the table as well. So I was like, damn, I might as well just copy it because nobody has it from what I've seen. And there isn't really a lot of reviews on YouTube right now. So I was like, all right, might as well take advantage and show you guys the product. If you guys are wondering what this is, it is actually a shoe freshener. As you guys can read on the bottom, it says the ultimate shoe freshener. The pills do come in this box, as you guys can see. It shows the pills in the front, and then on the top it says, who cares? But as you guys can see, it is a sturdy cardboard box. And the lift does lift off like that, and then you really don't need that. Then they have paper inside, don't need that either. This is the actual product. As you guys can see, they are two little pills. They are meant to go inside your shoe to keep them fresh. But before I forget, which I usually forget to say in a lot of my videos, is the pricing. These were $10 for two little pills. You can pick up the two little balls at Foot Locker, Foot Action, or Champs for like three bucks or six bucks. One of the two. But I will say they're not as good as this. But here they are, guys. Two pills. One for each shoe. Right shoe, left shoe. Or right shoe, left shoe. Whichever one you want. Doesn't matter, of course. And the way these work is they have these ventilation holes where inside them are those balls that you can hear rattling. I, can't, I don't know exactly what they are. They look like those balls that you find in those silicone packs that are meant to keep moisture out of the shoes. And when you first smell it when it's closed, it does have like a really sweet smell to it, which I like that smell, but unfortunately it's not strong enough to actually make the shoe smell good. So they do have three levels to the way this works. And I'm just gonna show you one for now since there's no point in showing you two. What you gotta do is just simply twist it. And then as you can, as you can see, if you go slow, it'll stop by itself. So I'm, that's level one, and you guys can see on this side that it only shows one little bar, which you know you're at level one. And then you spin a little more, and then you're at level two, and then level three, right there. So then do you see you have three levels of smell. And of course, the more you open it, the stronger it'll smell. I usually just leave it all the way open. Or another thing you can do is completely take it off and then just have that ultimate Ultimate. ultimate smell throughout your whole shoe. Here's a little ball that's inside there. As you guys can see, it looks like it's just somebody got a piece of toilet paper and just went like that to it and put it inside a piece of plastic. But before that, they sprayed it with some kind of cologne or something. This is just what actually makes the shoe smell strong and that's why when you twist it off and give it the certain levels, it's what produces a smell to go throughout your whole shoe so it doesn't smell like sh other than what i just showed you guys that's pretty much it to these pills i will say they are a little expensive unfortunately but then again you do get what you pay for and crep right now they're killing the game with shoe products such as cleaning protecting and i guess it's protecting as well since it does keep your shoe from smelling like whatever your foot smells like. I just want to say that Crepper Tex is killing the game right now. I want to give them a big shout out because the way they just sell their products and the way they present themselves, the way they're always going out to sneaker events, doing giveaways and all that, that's really big. It's a big marketing thing and it's pretty dope because these guys came out of London and it's crazy how big they are in the US. I actually met the owner of Crep and that was a big thing for me because it actually, it just motivates me to meet people that are high up there. But who knows what's in the future for Crep. They're probably gonna start selling like sneaker shields and just Shoe trees would be a good thing too. Just any product for shoes would be good for them. And I'm pretty sure they already have it in mind. But if somebody from Crep is watching this, those are just ideas I'm throwing out there. Sponsor me. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. We are trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by April 22nd, which is my birthday. Let's get it. But before I go, I do want to give a shout out to the big fan of the day. And yes, I did say big. I don't know why. And today's fan of the day is... I don't know if I give him a shout out yet. I probably have... I probably haven't, but either way, he's showing mad love in the comments every single video, so big shout out to him. His name is Kix101. Thank you for always showing love. Thank you for always giving feedback. I appreciate that a lot. Anyways, make sure you stay woke. Our sneaker sign out.